I'm really excited to be here at Welling Point State High School with Tamara, the art teacher, who's been working with some of our young students to capture what's really lovely um, and what the future might look, look like for our Birkdale Community Precinct. Um, they've been out on site. They're one of um, nine groups that have been selected to be a part of this journey. Um, and I'm kind of interested to know what you saw in their faces when you took them out on site. Um, and maybe talk a little bit about what you're seeing on these wonderful pieces of timber that was spelled timber, mm. um, which will be captured and kept for all many years. Yeah, so we, um, the, the kids had already done a little bit of research and a lot of them had a lot of stories anyway that connected them to that Birktail precinct anyway. So go, being able to go on site was really exciting for them. And so then we came back um, and solidified those ideas. They did lots of research and they've all been drawn to different aspects and some of them are the history but a lot of them are looking forward to what they will be able to experience on site. So we've got lots of designs to do with kayaking, bushwalking, that kind of thing. So that's a really exciting um, element for the students. Is this to Yelpa Creek? Uh, yeah. Okay. So give me a perspective. Is that coming? So it's coming out towards you. Okay. And that's going inland? Yes, that's sees the sky there. Yeah. And that's going inland. Yeah, okay. Excellent. Where did you get that thought from? Um, just going up the creek with my dad. You kayak or canoe? Yeah, kayak. Do you, I part of, up there. Are you um, a member of a canoe club or anything like that? No, just do it. Okay. Are you excited about the fact you might have a Olympic whitewater facility there where you could yeah. really try out your yeah. <laughs> canoeing and kayaking <laughs> skills? Yeah. The goat lady. Right. And oh, those are the fuzzy it's, flowers. I don't know what they're right. What's my envisionment of the Goat Lady? Okay, you, have you seen anything, any um, representations of her anywhere? Have you had researched that? Yeah. Well, you're very talented. What grade are you in? You obviously um, love your art. Yeah. So is that what you focus on here at school? These are the art subjects? Yeah. So tell me what you're painting. Um, it's just kind of an old beat down house because on the site there was some old beat down like farm and I thought it was pretty cool so the milking shed yeah I think so I think that's what it was there's a couple of pavilions once upon a time milk was actually delivered in uh, delivered to your home in like a 600 ml bottle and it had a lid on it that said pine dairy that they would have actually been selling milk from this particular where they built their cows and sell it on that's pretty cool. Yeah. Can you see the phone number? It had one number. Why? Because there weren't that many people living here back then, right? <laughs> so, and that's that's how milk was delivered. So we're working together for canoes on the creek. Okay. And hopefully they'll line up if she flips her. <laughs> oh, so this is a team. Oh, I see what you mean. You actually got... Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, so cool. Are you kayakers or canoeists, or you just like the idea of? I like the idea of it. Yeah. Do you think you'd give it a go? Yeah. I, re I reckon it'd be great. I think I was a bodyboard. No, stand up paddleboard. Oh, stand up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. On camp once. That was fun. Yeah, I bet. I would be so embarrassed because I would fall off for sure. But I think <laughs> sitting in a kayak, I think I could probably manage. Um, a few of them that I was speaking to um, throughout the past few weeks have been really excited about the fact that they'll be able to visit this place in the future and be able to say, oh, I, I did a project here. This yeah. was this was part of my high school life. And I like that makes me feel really great too that we were able to give them that opportunity as well. So it's as a teacher, it's a really good opportunity for me to be able to offer that to them. So um, yeah, we were really grateful that we got our application in and we were selected. So that was fantastic. Yeah, well, we've, you know, we've got a bit of a theme going that it's um, a place with a space for everyone. Yeah. And, um, you know, that connection, that those stories that I'm still discovering um, are something that we want to capture. And then we're, we're mm. doing that through your bit of work here. So we're looking forward to seeing you all out there on the yes. 27th, 28th yes, for we'll our open definitely. days. Um, hopefully yes. the weather will be shining and sunny and um, and hopefully into the future these young people will feel they've got a part of Birkdale Community Precinct to be proud of. Yeah, absolutely. Thanks so much for coming out oh, and visiting. Yeah. Excellent. Thank you.